So we're here at Evington Village Hall, which interestingly sits on the border of Hastings Lee. And uh, we're here with Rebecca, um, who's involved in what's happening here? The Rebecca? Hastings Lee Toddler Group. Excellent. And what does it mean to, to the community here, th this Village Hall, and, and especially for, for you as parents? Well, I know lots of different groups use the village hall, but for parents who live in really rural areas, yes. um, if you've got young children who not, are not yet at school or preschool, this might be your only contact with other parents and other children, um, opportunity to get out and see people, have Fantastic. a cup of tea, and just ha keep those links with your community because you can feel very isolated if you live yeah. in the rural areas. How long have you lived in the rural community? I've lived uh, just outside Hastings for 15 years. Right, great. So I've been here a long time. So you're time. here to stay. Yes, yeah. definitely. Brilliant. And so how often does the toddler group happen? Every week, uh, not in school holidays, but every Tuesday. Yeah. And do yeah. you get involved in volunteering for that? or? Yes, well, my sister runs it. Yeah. Um, and then I just come and help with the tidying up and making tea and things like that. But everybody chips in, so it's a really nice group. Yeah, and it's been running for a while? Yeah, it was running um, quite a few years ago. I came here when my oldest daughter was a baby, so that's over 10 years ago, and it's always been run by people within the community who yeah. live locally. Um, it went through a stage during lockdown where obviously it shut down, and then its yeah. future looked a bit uncertain. But fortunately, my sister and another lady who lives locally decided to pick it up and uh, carry on, and today has been their busiest day. Is it really? Yeah, yeah, yeah their busiest day. They've actually turned a profit today. Oh, wow. So, yeah, it's been Brilliant. a good day. Yeah. So how do you get new volunteers? You've got, with the nature of the project, kids grow up, you move on, and, and just new parents come you through do. always willing? I mean, word of mouth, in the past, it's appeared in the parish magazine. Certainly, if I see people around and about in parks or in the community and they've got a young one, I'll say, oh, have you heard about the toddler group? Yeah. So certainly word of mouth. Um, in the past we've advertised, it's difficult because obviously it's quite a small hall so you, there is a limit to how many you could have so they've never gone heavily into advertising yeah. but um, yeah sort of local advertising really and word of mouth. And do you know what else goes on in the hall? Do you see I, any other sessions? I know that there are walking groups, um, they advertised a lot in the parish magazine that they did walks through the Christmas holidays and they sometimes have walking groups that meet up here. Um, in the past, they've had uh, tea and coffee mornings, there's been WI meetings. Um, they've started doing, they used to in the past, and they've started now doing film nights where they have a um, fish and chip shop van come and they oh. put a film on and they do a children's film first and then a grown up film yeah. after. So, When's that? Yeah. They do it a few times a year, right. but they haven't done it for a while. But actually, the the Evington sort of community, uh, the people who run it, have in the past put together lots of things. Yeah. They've done pottery painting workshops here, for which have been subsidised for people who live in the local area. Oh, really? So they've done lots of things. That's yeah. really interesting for Village Halls Week because this year the theme is trying to get people to do unusual stuff or or maybe unusual is the wrong word, but stuff that hasn't happened before in the village hall. So those yeah. examples are really good. Yeah, there's so much. You, yeah, there's so much you can do. It's an, it's nice to have a big indoor space, particularly this time of year when people don't want to be outside. And yeah. So there's lots of things you so can do. So are you involved in the committee of the hall as well? Or? No. No, not no. yet. <laughs> no. Sounds like you might be. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> they they run it so well. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, fantastic. Um, one thing we're looking at, we work with an organisation called Applause, which is uh, a theatre group. So they take um, theatre to uh, rural communities and it's subsidised by the Arts Council. Mm -hmm. And so uh, live theatre comes to village halls, pubs and community centres. But this week, obviously, we're talking about village halls. Um, just letting you know about that, yeah. really. And, yeah. Uh, yeah, I well, think lots of people would be interested in that. Yeah. yeah. Great. Well, thanks for your time, Rebecca. No problem. Thank and you. And fantastic job. Keep it going. Yeah, thanks. Lovely. Thank you.